Hi everyone, my name's Tom, um, I'm from Kew Gardens. I'm going to briefly talk about um, a Python package I made a couple of years ago called NLMPy. Um, basic bit of background, um, um, in ecological situations we can't do a lot of experimentation. I've been doing a lot, of, a lot of work on wildfire recently. We can't go out and burn landscapes to figure out how our fire behaves. Um, so we do a lot of um, in silico experimentation with hypothetical landscapes. So what you see on the right hand side there is a little example of lots of different landscape types that could be patches of forest and grassland or elevational gradients, temperature gradients, that sort of thing. And um, we can create all different sorts of arrangements, compositions and explore how a pattern of the landscape might affect ecological processes. So I wrote that because I use that for a lot of my work. Um, I didn't have anything that was computationally efficient and there are lots of methods out there which I pulled together in this, this Python uh, package which is up on uh, the index. So if you, if you feel like doing some um, in silico landscape experimentation, maybe this would be useful. But the thing I wanted to highlight most really was um, sort of realised I might have missed my market a little bit and a lot of the ecologists are very um, are focused in terms of the coding that they do. So take up of the package of being a bit limited. So I'm currently in a situation where I've, I've written this in Python. I'd like to somehow enable it to be interfaced through R, but I haven't got the faintest idea how to go about doing that. So um, there's my email and Twitter thing, and I'm here. Um, so if anyone's got any clever ideas about how I can continue to just write code in Python and maintain the Python code to have this functionality, but somehow get people who only want to use R to sort of interact with it somehow, I'd love some help, please. Um, and if you want to know more about the package, of course, just ask me as well. Thanks.